everyone in the world in your religion to pray for the Oman people and the Emirates people because they will face the biggest storm. Second, I want to send a message to the goalkeeper coach of Maldives, his birthday today. So I hope for him long and happy life. Uh, for uh, Sri Lanka again, I think it's a difficult scale for us. It is not easy. Uh, we will uh, face a lot of problems with Sri Lanka, and I hope we can get at least one point from Sri Lanka. Uh, I know they are very aggressive in tackling, so our target we will focus on uh, to send one player out from them in the first half to make it easier for us. They are too much aggressive in uh, tackling, so they, we will use this advantage for us. That's all. Yeah. Sri Lankan coach say, said that Nepal is a team who play tactically very good and they execute the plan they plan for the match. Do you believe that this statement is accurate enough about your team? Maybe he make a trap for us, I think. They will surprise us tomorrow. So we must uh, not follow their words. We must focus uh, on the very difficult mission tomorrow we will have. Sri Lanka also a very good team, very strong team. We see them, we watch in, uh, them against Bangladesh. They play very well and they receive one goal from penalty kick. So, and also after the center of a player, they was playing very good. They didn't receive other goals. So they are very good. They are, uh, especially with the playing, I think the only team in South Cup playing with three center back is Sri Lanka. So I don't know if coach Amir will change this tomorrow or not. So we are in a confused situation now. But we will wait. And thank you for him for his words. And it is make me very happy, but I will be happy only if I take the three points tomorrow. Uh, to send one player out from Sri Lanka, Scott, are you serious about this statement? You see, you must take every point. Sri Lanka players making 67 tackling the last match. And from the 67, around 23 uh, fouls. So, why I don't use this? You must use everything. They will have tackling. One player make two tackling. Wrong. Yellow, yellow. Sent off. So, we will play with the ball tomorrow. And we will wait for their tackling. They are very aggressive in tackling. You will see tomorrow. They will tackling in every ball. The, uh, the center of a player last match, the first yellow card, he tackling on the head, head level. So, they love tackling. I will use this. Uh, Nepal uh, started with the win against defending champions. Uh, I'm sure Nepal supporters will have high expectations with your team now. How confident are players uh, for this tournament now? This is. Tomorrow game, it is our first match in the championship. We forget already Maldives game. We are ready only for Sri Lanka, and it will be our final match. We need to win. We must win. So if we're thinking in Maldives match, believe me, tomorrow we will try too much from sadness. So we must forget Maldives match. For me, I forget already. Yes, I am happy. but. We must forget it. And I think the players must do this. I will change you. Um, good afternoon, everyone. The pass is already finished now, fast. So, as Coach said, the Maldives game was now finished. There will be next step tomorrow. So, against Sri Lanka, definitely we are going to fight with them for three points. And as I said, in first Prince Conference, uh, where before we played against Maldives home team, we are Gorkali, we will fight until 1998 on pitch 
tomorrow also we'll repeat again same and we'll fight until 90 minutes for victories. And I believe myself and I believe in my team we are going to get some point tomorrow and we'll, we'll get victory sure. I believe in course also, I believe in everyone. <laughs> Another step to reach forward in under the goal Juma and Jungle mission they like soon. So tomorrow also all good step in go so and we are not taking like lightly, easily. Every match is so important in the long and growing so it's going to be super hard. But we are prepared well and my level you have experience in India and here in all these and as well as in your own country as well. You have played in a lot of South Championship tournaments as well. How do you see the level of the competition increasing in every year? We have seen that South tournament have been very competitive in last year. How do you believe about your team? How the progress are? 90 yeah. all, all overall the South all tournament all and your team. Okay. This is going on, but I think there, there was gap, you know, last year. It, it should be last season, you know, but there was no option, you know, so uh, they, they're not able to make last, last, last year. Uh, they, that's why a little bit, you know, I think break. Uh, but for me, uh, they're progressing a lot. And I see here uh, they are doing good and uh, they are improving also good. I think they should now increase team also. And uh, I heard South Federation, Federation uh, they are trying to change, I think, 2012, uh, I think, from 2012, but till now they are not confirmed yet. Maybe they will do in future. And uh, if there will be more strong team, it will be great in future. Thank you. Yes. So you are so much popular in the our um, with our fans. Any message for them? All the fans. Yeah. So a special message for them before the match. Okay. We must understand one thing. FIFA ranking slide because Pakistan before ban there was two hundred two. After ban, they be 198. They didn't play in match. The other teams play and lose. So the other teams losing points, Pakistan at the same level. I think if we thinking because Sri Lanka 205, we will beat them very easy. And some a lot of fans writing for me. We need to win 5-0. We need to win 6-0. We need to win. No, no, it's not easy. If I win tomorrow 1-0. I will be more than happy. I need only the three points. I, if I will score in the first minute, I will tell my players, come back to defend it. I will not open the game tomorrow. Tomorrow, all the fans must understand, we didn't play with AZ team. The difficult team in the, this tournament is Sri Lanka. Especially when we know Sri Lanka Federation already announced they will change the coach after the championship. So no one has anything to lose. So, but we have three points from first hour match. So we scared too much. Because if we don't win tomorrow, why we win the first match? It's not logic. So tomorrow I will not open the game. They must be patient. If we score in the 90 minutes, it's the same for scoring in the first minutes. The most important, we finish the game with three points. And uh, I love all Nepali people. Thank you so much.